Well, a multi-million dollar donor behind the airport name change from McCarran to Harry Reid International Airport tells me he isn't happy. It's been three years and the new signage still isn't complete. Former Diamond Resort CEO and founder Stephen J. Klubeck reached out to me upset because he donated $2.7 million and he says he brought in the Kirk Kikorian Foundation when more money was needed. Now he wants to know what's the holdup with the signage. We change signs in hotels within months. To not be able to do this throughout the airport is, is a travesty. It's a travesty to the donors. This is hard earned dollars. We did this with no taxpayer dollars. This is private donations. The original budget was $5 million. And the signage that they put forth with regard to the monument signs didn't exemplify what the county commission approved, Harry Reid International, period. So we reached out to Clark County for answers and they sent us a statement that reads in part, quote, Clark County strongly refutes the allegation that the work to change the name of the airport to Harry Reid International has not been moving forward as planned. And they go on to say the Department of Aviation has been transparent with the process. And since the project started during the pandemic, supply chain issues and rising construction costs impacted projects. Well, there are two major signs they say will be completed come this fall. The monument signs at Tropicana and Paradise and Trop and Koval and the welcome to Las Vegas signs at the D and E gates.